Okay, this is Bronx Street Cup. This is a shooting game which you can use a light gun if you've got one or a joystick, as I haven't got one, so I'm going to use a joystick. Now you get a massive cursor. And we're training, I don't really train. You, you train to be a cop. You know, before you can go out on the older Bronx, on the hard streets of the Bronx, you got to be able to you got to be able to tell the difference between the criminals and the civilians. Now, the criminals, they've got masks on, they're wearing a gimp's outfit and they've got a gun. Or something or other. And civilians, they're, they're old pensioners. They keep popping up. Now, I'm not sure if this is easier or harder of a joystick. I want to think it's easier because I remember light gun games. Uh, I only, only played it once in Spectrum. It was Operation Wolf, and I was around my mate's house, and we we aimed. It said, "Do you want to play again?" or something like that. And we aimed exactly where it said yes, exactly right against the screen, and we still missed. So that's how accurate it used to be. I played a game a bit like this on the Commodore, actually, a light gun game. I don't think it's the same one, but anyway. You should shoot them. This is really boring. Make sure you don't shoot the uh, pension. I mean, for all I know, she's got a bloody rifle or bazooka under that uh, under that long coat of hers, but perhaps not. Ooh. Out of time. We've got enough. Ooh. You have graduated. I'm fucking brilliant. Now onto the Bronx. This is the real stuff. Hello, robbery in progress. We've got to stop robbery. This sounds exciting. Hello. Now these uh, criminals look familiar. They've had the decency and the well, the kindness to uh, dress exactly as they did in the training program. So it's a pretty easy to spot. Hello. They had a shot at us. You nearly hit me. Careful. I'm trying my best, you bastard. Uh, it's like whack a mole, isn't it? But we fucking cops and bloody robbers. Look at them. Stay still, you f bastards. Bloody hell, you've got the bloody pinchers keep popping up there. What are you doing? Fuck off. What are they doing there? You were nearly it. Nearly it. Be more careful. That's taking a piss, isn't it? Not exactly very inspiring, is it? Dirty Harry, this isn't. What are they doing? What's the pinch to keep popping up for? You know, that's typical old women, isn't it? Fucking you know, hell, they see something going on, the cur curtain twitching. They have to have a look, don't they? Stick right out the window, see what's going on. Fucking, oh, I'll shoot them, just tell, you know, just to... Just so they don't get in the fucking way. Rubbish. Anyway, seven more guys to kill. It's nice that your curse is so big, because it's hard to miss, but... Fucking hell. I feel like variation in the game is a. Oh, got him. They were pretty crap robbers, weren't they? They actually tried robbing the place, they bounced something down like idiots. They might have actually done. Uh, robbed the place, but never mind. What's his next? Subway? I bet this is nothing like the last level. What do you reckon? Oh, look, looks, this looks vaguely familiar. Oh look, it's got even the same people. Granny fucking Smith's back. Fucking fidgety kangaroo fucking criminals. Bloody hell. This must have took a long time to program this. Bang bang. What are they doing? Keep still you bastards. What are these old people popping up for? You know, piss off back home. It's typical of old people, isn't it? You know, and they've got some bloody uh, queue to be uh, in somewhere, you know, holding up some queue in the post office, getting a pension. Do something useful! Bloody hell, that's, what, is it, what is it with old people anyway? Have you noticed, whenever, they've got all the, they never work, they've got all the time in the day to collect their pension, you know, or to get their newspaper, or their, you know, their Murray Mints, or whatever they do. But they only ever go out when it's lunchtime, when all everyone else is working, they come into the, uh, when they come into the shop to get their lunch, the old people are there in the way. Fucking, they deserve shooting. All training, oh, bollocks, back at school. Oh, God, what do you reckon? Will it be the same two people again to shoot? Ooh. Oh, well, there's the granny. There's the man in the gimp suit. 
And what the fuck is that? It's like a fucking frisbee. What's that going to do with fucking Bronx? I don't think you need the average beat cop on the uh, Bronx uh, needs to worry about frisbee throws, do they? I mean, can you imagine that? You know? Attention all units, we have a dangerous situation. There's a frisbee thrower on this corner of 4th and 5th. Proceed with caution. 10-4. I mean, fucking rubbish, isn't it? A bit of variation, but you know, frisbees, I say it's frisbees, but clay pigeon, isn't it? Or it could be a, an extra, fr uh, one of the mother ships from Space Invaders, but it's the same old shit, isn't it? I could at least change a fucking woman, you know, I'm pissed off with fucking Granny Smith. I'm not convinced it's a fair representation of the, uh, the population anyway, I mean, I'm sure the average civilian in the Bronx isn't a, a white granny with a fucking walking stick. No, she looks like she's sort of supposed to be more at home on uh, Bournemouth, on the seafront there, I mean, than the Bronx, but what can you do? Anyway, pretty uninspiring game. If you've got a light gun, it's probably not too bad. I haven't got a light gun, though. They're not that great, but there's not much to it. Pretty tiresome. Pretty as tiresome to watch as it is to play, but I reckon you could have a bit of fun with this. You had a few mates round, you know, if you're pissed and you had the light gun, but apart from that, rubbish. Uh -huh. Out of ammo. What's happening here? Not enough. It's bollocks. Bollocks. I demand a recount. Quite disappointed there. Eh? Obviously, the Bronx isn't for me, but I thought I was a pretty good copper. I didn't. Sh I didn't shoot the granny. I mean, the restraint I showed not to shoot her when she kept popping up, and it's her own fault she gets shot. She's a f she should be at home or something, you know, knitting a jumper rather than getting away, popping her head out the window all the time. Anyway, I'm going to give this game 6 out of 10 because if you did have a light gun, it'd probably be a different sort of game, it'd be a bit more fun. Even if the light guns are shit, so 6 out of 10. Not, not too bad, to be fair.